Hey everyone, it's Tyler with Everyday EV, and today we're gonna to be talking about a special video with our Volkswagen ID4. Today we're gonna to be going over the top three accessories that you should buy for your ID4 if you live somewhere where it snows, like us here in Cleveland. So let's go ahead and get started with our top three accessories. For the first one that we have today, Definitely important here in Cleveland because we get a lot of snow and ice and honestly slush too. So the first thing that we did is we bought winter wheels from Tire Rack. These are on 18x8 American Eagle five-spoke wheels. These are black. You can also get them in silver if you don't like black. We went with the Bridgestone Blizzx DMV2s. I've had a similar set on multiple of our cars before, and these are honestly my favorite type of winter tires. They're highly recommended by Tire Rack and everybody else who has winter tires. I have to say, after a few hundred miles that we've put, we've probably put maybe five, 600 miles on this car since we had these installed, they're honestly very, very quiet. You hear a little bit of tire noise if you're over 65 miles an hour, but they're honestly super quiet, super comfortable, and we love these for winter time. We haven't gotten a whole lot of snow in Cleveland, but we know it's coming. It's almost the end of December, getting into January, which is our snowy season. Second accessory too that I just wanna highlight really quick is we actually put in these mud flaps. These are actually from Volkswagen 2. These are actually ID4 accessories that you can get at your local dealership or on the Volkswagen website. I'll be sure to include a link in the description below of where you can purchase those. We just thought this would be helpful because we didn't want a whole bunch of salt to splash up on the side of the car and get that dirty because we kind of put a ceramic coat on it over the summertime and I just don't want that to get ruined, honestly. But I did put another coating, a quick coating on the car just to kind of help protect it for the winter time. If we move to the back, we actually, what we did for the ID4, because we have a rear wheel drive, it comes with a staggered set of wheels. So what we did for the winter time is we actually did a square set. So these are the same as they are on the front, just because we wanted to be able to rotate the wheels just in case we you know, need to a few thousand miles down the road. We also installed the rear mud flaps as well, same thing. Uh, those were actually a pretty quick install, a little bit of a hassle on the rear bumper, but they actually weren't too bad. If we walk around to the back, we didn't change anything back here, <laughs> as you can see. But you can also see <clears throat> these mud flaps do look super nice from behind. I actually really like how these are, because then we actually get a lot less salt and dirt on the side of the car, which is definitely a preference for me. But here, same side, still have the same 18 by 8 uh, black wheels for the winter time. And honestly, I think it looks really nice. Like, we were actually pretty impressed with how these looked once we got them on. It looks really cool. I'm actually really happy with how these wheels and tires turned out from Tire Rack. If you're wondering how much these are, these came to about $1,300 with uh, Ohio sales tax. So honestly, not too bad. They were about $150 per wheel and then the tires were about 170 a piece. So honestly, for a peace of mind in the snowy climate, because we have a rear-wheel drive car, that's honestly the best deal that we could possibly find. And Tire Rack has the best customer service ever. So that's it for the first two accessories. All right, let's talk about the third and final accessory that we bought for our ID4. It's not gonna be on the outside. It's actually gonna be here on the inside. So one of the things that we actually did is we replaced the floor mats that came with the car. We kind of got those rubberized uh, mats from Volkswagen from the dealership. We also got the fabric ones, the carpet ones. I don't like carpet floor mats at all as a preference. What we actually did is we actually bought the Muddy Buddy floor mats from Volkswagen themselves. So these floor mats are actually made by WeatherTech for Volkswagen. So if you buy the WeatherTech ones, they're gonna fit and look the exact same as the Muddy Buddy. It's just this has the Muddy Buddy Volkswagen logo on it anyways. I really like these because you, they easily fit within the seams of the carpet and the door sills. So you actually have a proper fit. And what I like about these is you can easily rip them out. They kind of clip in. And then that way you can just water, you know, wash them down with water and then they're good to go. You can obviously see we've had some people in the back seat and it's a little bit dirty right now, but I like that the dirt is contained for these floor mats. And that's been my favorite part about getting these is I wanted all weather mats that had the lip lined up to the sill. That way I wouldn't have to worry about any like dog hair or dirt or mud getting into the carpet because that's honestly no fun to clean up and no dog owner wants to clean up 
their own dog hair on carpet. It's not fun. We've done it before. <clears throat> so that's our third accessory that we have for ID4, just to kind of help us out with winter. But as a little outro, I just want to give you guys a little bit more information on our snow tires, just from what we've noticed within the last five, 600 miles. So we've noticed our efficiency, you know, we've been kind of having some weird weather changes here in Cleveland. We've had some 60 degree days. We've had some low 20 degree days. So honestly, our weather is just all over the place here in Northeast Ohio. One thing that we have noticed though, is with the winter tires, we're averaging about 2.5 to 2.9 miles to the kilowatt. Whereas our standard OEM wheels that we have the 20s on the car as well, we were averaging about 3.2 to 3.8, just kind of depending on the day. So because we are in colder weather, we also have colder climate, we also have different weather effects. We do have lots of ice, snow, and whatnot here. We have noticed a range loss, but honestly, it's a winter time, so we kind of expected that. But these are honestly probably one of my favorite wheels we have gotten in tire packages from Tire Rack. They've been very, very helpful, and I feel very, very confident that this car will be able to go through anything and everything this winter. So guys, that is it for our accessories. We just had the wheels, tires, the mud flaps, and then our interior mats, and that's it. We hope to provide you guys with more information as we go through the actual snow and ice this year to see how these actually hold up. We're super excited about that. So. If you liked this video, be sure to like and subscribe to our channel so that we can publish more content for the ID4 in the wintertime and other electric cars. But once again, take care everybody, stay safe, and make every day electrifying.